that's me. Yes, I do. Yep. And this. Are you going to read out the whole thing? I'm a time traveller. Or I was. I'm stuck. In 1969. We're stuck. All of space and time he promised me. Now I've got a job in a shop. I've got to support him. Martha. Sorry. Quite possibly. Afraid so. Thirty-eight. Yeah. People don't understand time. It's not what you think it is. Complicated. Very complicated. People assume that time is a strict progression of cause to effect, but actually, from a non-linear, non-subjective viewpoint, it's more like a big ball of wibbly-wobbly, timey-wimey stuff. It got away from me, yeah. Well, I can hear you. Well, not hear you exactly, but I know everything you're going to say. Look to your left. I've got a copy of the finished transcript. It's on my autocue. I told you I'm a time traveller. I got it in the future. Yeah, uh, wibbly wobbly, timey wimey. What matters is we can communicate. We have got big problems now. They have taken the blue box, haven't they? The angels have the phone box. Creatures from another world. Only when you see them. Lonely assassins, they used to be called. No one quite knows where they came from, but they're as old as the universe, or very nearly. And they have survived this long because they have the most perfect defense system ever evolved. They are quantum locked. They don't exist when they're being observed. The moment they are seen by any other living creature, they freeze into rock. No choice, it's a fact of their biology. In the sight of any living thing, they literally turn to stone. And you can't kill a stone. Of course, a stone can't kill you either, but then you turn your head away. Then you blink. And oh yes, it can. That's why they cover their eyes. They're not weeping. They can't risk looking at each other. Their greatest asset is their greatest curse. They can never be seen. Loneliest creatures in the universe. And I'm sorry. I am very, very sorry. It's up to you now. The blue box, it's my time machine. There is a world of time energy in there. They could feast on forever, but the damage they could do could switch off the sun. You have got to send it back to me. And that's it, I'm afraid. There's no more from you on the transcript. That's the last I've got. I don't know what stopped you talking, but I can guess. They're coming. The angels are coming for you. But listen, your life could depend on this. Don't blink. Don't even blink. Blink and you're dead. They are fast, faster than you could believe. Don't turn your back. Don't look away and don't blink. <laughs>